the United States and Europe are fully united. This morning, I had a long conversation with uh, our NATO allies, German Chancellor Schultz, French President Macron, Prime Minister Sanuk, and the Italian Prime Minister uh, Maloney, uh, to continue our close coordination and our full support of Ukraine. Because you all know I've been saying this for a long time. The expectation on the part of Russia is we're going to break up. We're not going to stay united. But we are fully, thoroughly, totally united. With spring approaching, Ukrainian forces are working to defend the territory they hold and preparing for additional counteroffensives. To liberate their land, they need to be able to counter Russia's evolving tactics and strategy on the battlefield in the very near term.